with Formula One headed for much needed summer break, well, it's the perfect time to make our assessment. Since the championship is done for Charles Leclerc despite having a car to lead this championship, the reality is Max Verstappen has enjoyed the most of Leclerc's errors and mishaps, and there it is, 80 points off in the championship. In this video, we are presenting how much potential points Leclerc lost during first half of this season. Also, we will present how much Verstappen gained throughout and at last, we will present net result. So, here we go. Wow, can you believe that? With two reliability force DNFs in Spain and Azerbaijan, two driver errors in Imola and France, and three strategic errors in Monaco, Silverstone and Hungary, Leclerc has lost humongous 118 potential points so far, while Verstappen has just lost 55 potential points with two DNFs in Bahrain and Australia and problem in British GP. And if we look at points gain tally, Verstappen has gained 33 points while Leclerc has gained just 16 points. So, yeah, there you go, net Verstappen gain is 80 points, as reflected in the championship standings. No wonder, when you lose that much of points, you are bound to be that far to be honest. Well, enough of the blame, Ferrari are never winning the championship with this kinds of performance. The radical management change is a must in Ferrari garage. If not, same old story. Good here and there but never enough. So yeah, that's it for this analysis video. What do you guys think about this analysis? Please pass an honest opinion about this video, and also about Ferrari's performance in the comments section. And at last, I promise to bring these kinds of videos in future as well. So please stay tuned by subscribing my channel. Thank you very much.